Hi everybody, Reese Davis with you, bringing you the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 pregame show presented by Nissan, innovation that excites. In a matter of moments, a man carrying a sousaphone will high step his way onto the field at Ohio Stadium, much to the delight of a sellout crowd, and he will dot the I. But believe it or not, there is something that's more important. That is dotting the I in win. And that's what the Buckeyes hope to do in Columbus today. That's going to do it for us. Thanks for checking out the pregame show. NCAA college football action coming right at you. Brad and Kirk on the call. David and I are back at halftime. to see what should be a great football game. Let's head down to the coin sauce now. It's brought to you by Coke Zero. Real Coca-Cola taste at zero calories. Enjoy everything. We're ready to get this one underway as the teams are lined up for the opening kick. And this season is officially underway. Wilson from the six. And down he goes at the 34. Ohio State's coaching staff, the fans, I think everybody's been waiting to see this kid play, and here he is. Well, he's a star quarterback. He seems to bring everything to the table. The crowd, I think, senses he's ready to have a big day. And when your star quarterback feels good at playing at home and he gets off to a good start, some big things can happen for this offense. So here comes the offense taking the field for the first time today. Runs right for a nice game. Around five yards there on the option keep. That brings up second and five. Second down and five. Ball on the 39-yard line. Pulls it in and he's in the open field. He's at midfield. He gets hit out of bounds at the 46. Superb effort by the receiver to come down with that ball. Uh, this comes down to the timing between the quarterback and the receiver. And the result, again, a nice play for the offense. Passes in and it's picked off by the safety. And now he's got room to run. He's taken down at the 13-yard line. It's the safety who's in the right place at the right time. The quarterback has to know where the safety is when he makes this kind of throw. Right here, he just tried to force something that wasn't there. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 13. Zips it to the tight end. Touchdown, Bulls! How about the tight end? This guy can play some football. You bet he can. He's such an all-around player. He's just as good at blocking as he is at catching the football. He makes the P8. Donaldson has his kick team lined up, and he is set to kick this one off. He's to the 20. And he's taken down at the 24-yard line. The Bulls are right where they want to be early in this one, partner. Well, this is what their coach talked about, getting off to a great start. The defense did their job, and it's nice to see the offense move the ball down the field and also get some points on the board. The quarterback threw an interception on their last drive. Let's see if they can be more successful here. Anytime you give the ball away, it's a disappointment. So these guys want to show that they can hang on to it. Slings it. And down he goes. First down, 10 to go. Ball on their own 41. Go 
over the middle. Running back's got it. He's tackled right around the 42-yard line. You know, if you use him in this offense the right way, it's almost like you have an extra wide receiver. He's that good. He's at the 30, makes it out to about the 26. It's first and 10. Ball on the 26. Rolling out to the right side. Under pressure. He's pushed out of bounds around the 16-yard line. The defense snuffed out the option play pretty well there. Yeah, but they didn't do it quickly enough. Comes it right to his fullback. Big play there, and now they're looking at first and goal. Nice pickup as they connect on the pass play. But they look to be in sync right now. They're both reading the defense properly, and the result is a nice game. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Great job of finding the space to run and just bursting in for six. They'll line up for the extra point in an attempt to tie the game. He splits the uprights with the extra point. So that's an eight-play, 77-yard drive, and that's good for a touchdown. Every drive is important in a tie game. I look for both sides to come out with some urgency. Caught out in the open. Sanchez makes the reception. Carries the ball for a nice game. Good for a game of six yards. Third down. Man left, man left. Four down, four down. Mike five. Mike These five. fans are showing you why teams hate check, to check. come here, folks. Check three, check three. Tries to fit it in there, but it's picked off. Brought down at about the 43-yard line. the 43 yard line first down fires quickly to the tight end and he's tackled at the 33 30-yard line. Just a simple draw play here. Back does a nice... First and 10. Ball on the 30-yard line. Throws out to the tight end again completes. And he's taken down right around the 18-yard line. You know, having a playmaker at tight end makes those linebackers think twice before they make a move. That could be just enough time for the quarterback. Dangerous throw. This one's picked off. There he goes. Inside the 10. Touchdown, Touchdown Buffalo. And he tacks on the extra to be ranked much higher. Here's a hotly contested battle. Buffalo, ready to kick this one off. He's to the 20. He's got the corner. Down the sideline. 
And he's taken down at the 48. It's going to be interesting now to see if this quarterback can put that last throw behind him. You know, you wonder about the mindset and the psyche of this football team after the turnover on the last possession. It's going to be interesting to see what they're really made out of here. This is an important possession for this offense. So it's second down, and they're only about a foot away from picking up the first down. Feeds it to the back. Nice run up the middle. They should continue to run the ball. So it's second down now, and they need about four yards to pick up the first. Go hard. Get up, get up, get up. And they make the stop at about the 17-yard line. players go down earlier but it looks like he might be able to get back in the lineup defense would like to come up with another big play like they did in the last trip for this offense in the red zone with the interception and he's level at the seventh that'll make it second in inches it's second down and they're about the length of the football from the first down marker tackle made at the six and this play is number eight on the drive Touchdown, Bucks! The halfback just plowed his way into the end zone. Yeah, but it wasn't all him. The offensive lineman just pancaked the defense on that one. Will be tied with the extra point. And he hits the PAT. An eight-play, 48-yard drive. And a touchdown as a result. We're deadlocked right now at 14. He's scrambling, and down he goes at the 40-yard line. No gain. That makes it second. We've time. played one, 14 apiece. to the action here in the second quarter. It's been a good one and a tight one at this point. He makes his way to about the 48. Lee looking to knock one inside the 20 here on this front. Gets it away. Wait a minute, he's going to throw. And it's incomplete. The defense holds and the ball will change hands. Great play there by the D. It's early in the season, but they showed they don't get rattled at all. I give them a lot of credit. This is the point in the game where you don't want to make any mistakes that give the other guys a reason to feel more confident going into halftime. Nice run, and he's brought down. Game seven in play. That'll bring up second and three. Second down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. And he's tackled after positive yardage. Zips it to the tight end. They'll bring him down at the 25. Kick is up, and it's off the upright, and it's good. Williams is the deep man awaiting the return. He fields the punt at the 20. He's 
taken down at the 45. The Buckeyes right now are getting the play out of their quarterback that they expected, maybe even better than they expected. And now, as we get near halftime, there's going to have to be some adjustments made on the other side of the ball. Well, the defense has got to be happy we're getting close to halftime so they can go back to the drawing board and try to figure out a way to slow down this quarterback. Uh, I think that more often than not, you look back at the first half and you think about, okay, let's eliminate this, this, and this, and let's maybe try a completely different way of, of trying to attack him. In my opinion, they've got to take some chances. Gets it, he's in space. And he's tackled around the 18-yard line. First and 10, ball on the 18. The 10, gains his way to the seven. Touchdown, Buckeyes! He's got two touchdowns on the ground today. That was just an excellent individual effort to find the end zone. And he adds the extra point. A five-play, 56-yard drive, and they add seven points to the scoreboard. And Brad, right now, the offensive line just winning the battle in the trenches, opening up. Lee is waiting for the snap. Williams takes it at the 45, and he's tackled at the 48. The Buckeyes are just cruising through this first half, Herbie. Really a comfortable lead here. Yep, but still a lot of football left to be played. they got to remember that it's a four-quarter game, and even though that first half went pretty well, things can change in a hurry. They ran the ball very well on their last drive, and it resulted in six. He's got it with room to run, and he's taken down around the 38-yard line. That'll make it second and inches. So it's second down, and they're only about a foot away from picking up the first down. Watch 36, 36 to Mike. Tackle at the 27-yard line. Second and eight. Ball on the 25-yard line. Slings it quickly to his halfback again. And he scores! Touchdown! And he tacks to be intimidating for an opposing team. in the open. He's taken down around the 37-yard line. Well, we played a half of football. Ohio State's lead is 17. zone for a touchback. Ohio State's coaching staff will go out tonight, and I think the offensive coordinator should buy the defensive coordinator his meal. Well, the defense has been great. There's no doubt about it. Bring it out to the 20. Ohio State's coaches just got to be happy. I'd love to coach a kid like this. Oh, I think After the sack, it's now fourth and long. Let's see if he aims for the sideline and tries to get this thing down deep in their own territory. Tackle made at the 40-yard line. Big stop by the defense. Great play there by the D. It's early. Second and 15. Ball on the 35-yard line. And he's tackled at about the 43-yard line. From 
from the 40-yard line. Second down. Rolling out to the right side. Throws it in a hurry. And he's taken down at the 31. It's fourth down. So the kicker comes out. He'll try to put three points on the board. It's up. Looks long enough. And it's good. Boy, he had plenty of distance there and pushed it through. Very impressive leg strength. 34-14, Ohio State. Ohio State ready to kick this one off. Short kick. He didn't get a hold of that one. Jones fields it at the 24. Whoa, he just took a licking. Buffalo's getting stopped right now. They're unable to get anything going here in the third quarter. Well, I think what they have to do at this point is they've got to get into a little bit more of a hurry-up mode, a little bit more urgency. High five. That's three down and one to go. Ohio State's in front by 20. Welcome back to the action here as we resume play here in quarter number four. Nice run there. So it's fourth down and the offense is still on the field. This defense not wanting to give an inch here. He gets out to about the 35-yard line. And this is the ninth play of the current drive. Slings it. He's at the 20. What a play, and that'll set up a first and goal. It's going to be tough for this team, obviously, to get back into this football game, but I just love to see the pride they're playing with. They are determined to play into the final whistle, and they're not giving up. You hear that, kids? They're not giving up, and that's a key. He's on the run. Decides to tuck it in, and he's got space. It's away from him. Touchdown. He just put his eyes on that end zone and ran with some real purpose there. And he converts the extra point. A 10-play, 61-yard drive, and they come away with seven points. They got into the end zone last time. Let's see if they can match that on this possession. Gets it, he's in space. And they push him out at the 26-yard line. Six-yard pickup. It's a decent pick. Really a tough spot for an offense to be in against this crowd in this stadium. Gets it out quickly. And down he goes, around the 30-yard line. Call it a gain of four yards. Check, check. That makes it first and 10. On the hook, 36. Set, green attack. And they got him. He just blew past the blockers and dragged the quarterback down. So another third down here, and this time it's third and long. Three down, three down. Really one of the very tough places to play in college football, and it's no different today. Makes the catch, and he might take it to the 10. Touchdown, Bulls. Only a one-score difference now after that big, big touchdown. And he tacks on the extra point. 
So that's a six-play, 80-yard drive, and it's good for seven points. Brett, I thought the key to that drive really had a lot to do with the quarterback and the receivers getting in sync, making it very tough for the defense to slow them down. The score now, 34-28. They bring him down, and they bring him down hard on that one. The offense lining up in a victory formation, and he takes a knee. We should just see the quarterback take a knee right here, winding down the rest of this clock. 